I was a pretty sporty little girl. I definitely didn't have a problem playing any sport as long as I was playing something. Ellie was a happy kid. She wanted to play everything and anything. Nippers, cricket, soccer, uh, you name it, she played it. My mum and dad never made me feel like there was a girl sport and a boy sport. I was seven, I was playing football and I was actually playing really well and had this boy that was getting really frustrated because I kept beating him. He turned around and he just pushed me over. A heck will come from the crowd to put a dress on and go back to netball. I was upset, I was hurt. From my perspective it actually really opened my eyes and it was really important for Ellie to see that she's got a strong role model that can call gender bias out. The Daughters and Dads Active and Empowered program is a world first evidence-based program that is tackling gender bias and empowering dads and daughters to advocate for change. 70% of dads don't think they have a unique and independent influence on their daughter's well-being. When we looked at the literature, there had never been a program that had targeted fathers. The dads, they immediately become more involved in their daughter's lives. They improve their parenting, there's better co-parenting, but they also become gender equity advocates. The dads often speak about how the girl's confidence is growing, how their skills, their sports skills, are accelerated greatly, how much more resilient they are, but also how they know how to overcome the gender inequities that they will face through developing critical thinking. When they said they were doing daughters and dads football facilitated training, I said to dad, well, let's do it. I got there and an hour and a half later, I left with the biggest smile on my face and I just said, I need this in my life. Really innovative aspect of this whole research program is that Daughters and Dads Active and Empowered Training is now a university course that primary and PE student teachers can elect to study. And they learn to become accredited facilitators and can go out and engage with the program in the community. The way that the University of Newcastle has set out their courses and their curriculum really prepares teachers for teaching today. And it's just an amazing resource that the students have right at their fingertips. The university course is relevant, it's real world, it's cutting edge, it's impactful and inspiring. We have had more than 4,000 daughters and dads participate in the program across Australia and the world. And just as importantly, we have trained more than 300 facilitators to deliver the program. And we have just a huge list of interested sports and other countries who want to be involved in the Daughters and Dads program. The University of Newcastle is really changing girls' lives by putting this program out and it lets girls build such a brighter future, more confident, more powerful. Your body is an instrument, not an ornament. If we can teach the girls that your body is so much more than what it looks like, your body is strong, your body is powerful, that's the most important thing. <laughs>